Welcome to Pro Tools Expert, my name is Dan Cooper. In this four part video series, we are taking a look at four Waves plugins that can quickly transform dull sounding vocal tracks into radio ready mixes. This is the last episode in the series. Before I show you which plugin that we're going to look at in this video, let's have a quick recap of the plugins that we've looked at so far. So the first episode, we had a look at this Greg Wells voice centric, also took a look at this Butch Figs vocals, Eddie Kramer tape, and in this video, we're going to be taking a look at this Waves Studio Rack. It's a free plugin. It hosts Waves plugins. You can reorder them, which is great. Very quickly go into each of the plugin and adjust the settings. You can bypass the plugins. And what I like about this is that you can save your Waves plugin chains. So let's say you design your own perfect vocal processor chain. Why reinvent it each time that you start a new mix? Why not recall that? If so, if you've got let's say eight plugins in a vocal chain, you save yourself time the next time you start a session, just load up Studio Rack and load up your favorite vocal processor chain. For me, these four plugins are generally my go-to for mixing vocals. They're really easy to use and sound absolutely brilliant. So let's put them to work in Studio Rack. Let's hear what we can do to this vocal. Deep within my mind, I see a sign that's encouraging me. A little bit of DSing, Way not too much. Way beyond the light, I see a sign. Let's stop living in fear. A little bit of EQ after the DSA. Bring it in. Once upon a time. I stay. Not too much, just a little bit in the top end. In the eye. Let's go back round again and introduce the compressor, the CLA 2A. Deep within my mind, I see a sign. That's encouraging me way beyond the light. I see pushing it quite hard, but I like the sound, it's quite intense. Now, let's apply a little bit of delay. Deep within my mind, it's just the dry, wet control. Sign that's encouraging me way beyond the light. I see a sign. Play around the filters. Let's stop living in fear. I cry. A low fi Deep within my mind, I see a sign. And there you have it, Wave Studio Rack, really cool Waves plugin hoster. And if I wanted to use this in a different session, very easy. I just can hit save. And there we have it. I can recall this at any time in any other session, also in any other DAW that has Waves Studio Rack. So I can also share that preset with me mates, me buddies, me colleagues. Anyone that wants to use this. Anyway, I hope you guys got something from this. To watch the other videos in this series, do click the link in the description below. For more information on all the Waves plugins that we have featured in this series, do check out the Waves website. I hope you guys got something from this. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again soon.